Sagittarius. Sagittarius, welcome. We're going to do a general read for you today. Keep in mind, um, we're going to look at your current energy, desire, outcome, what's working for you, what you need to be aware of. Uh, we're also going to clarify each one of those, and then at the end I'll pull three cards around that, <clears throat> just to make sure that we have everything sort of covered. So let's figure out what your current energy is, Sagittarius. Ooh, the star. The star. Just hope, healing. Somebody's in that um, sort of wishing state is what I get. The desire is the Three of Pentacles. The Three of Pentacles is the idea that you're able to put effort into something. And I see this as kind of like this is like a family situation here. And then the outcome we have is the wheel. The wheel is the card that there are new things that are starting to happen. This is also your energy showing up. <clears throat> so possibly the beginning of something new and the end of something old. Seven of Swords shows up as in what you is working for you. Seven of Swords is kind of an interesting thing that, that shows up. And that is that maybe things aren't going as you anticipated. And you may really need to figure uh, this out. We have the moon that shows up there. <clears throat> and that's kind of like, hey, you really don't know everything that's going on behind the scenes. And then we have the chariot that shows up is what you need to be aware of. Chariot is something that's very moving quickly. Uh, it's also that uh, it's triumph over difficulties, but... You gotta you gotta show that strength and hold on. Fortunately, with these two horses in this card, they're going in the same direction. That said, let's get into clarifying this. Why is the star here? Five of Swords, the Strength card, and the Nine of Cups. It's like there's been a lot that's gone on in the past with the Five of Swords here. There's just been a lot of... As I look at this card, this one actually just gives me a headache. There's a lot of headaches that you've had to overcome in order to realize the things that you want with the Nine of Cups here. What you want in your emotions, material fulfillment, the things that sort of we require as human beings. I'm almost brought down to that whole Maslow's um, pyramid. Uh, the Three of Pentacles, clarified by the King of Wands, the Seven of Pentacles, and the Queen of Cups. The working and starting to take, you know, your time and working forward, uh, taking that... Um, action towards creating a future that you can feel um, where you can just feel whole is kind of what I'm getting here uh, that this whole thing is based on you know I want to feel like things have come together like what I've done matters this brings us to the wheel in your outcome page of cups four of pentacles there might, as things are changing for you, uh, this Page of Cups shows up. This could be a romantic offer. This could be some type of um, something that really makes you feel hopeful, but you're afraid to lose it. And then we have Temperance showing up saying, yeah, you know what, I'm afraid to lose sort of um, what either something you've had in the past or that you're holding on to this offer as a means of, of sort of, uh, it's going to sound weird, either stability so that it's, so that the change doesn't affect you that much. <clears throat> but either way, as this offer comes in, it has you changing and healing, which is a great thing to have. So the Seven of Swords, the Sun, the Fool, and the hangman. Wow. So things aren't going according to plan. And that may be a good thing. And it looks like it is here. 
because sometimes we need to adapt, change, and overcome. The Sun card, the Fool, and the Hanged Man, this is like, you know what? Everything's going to be okay. Take the leap. Look at this differently. Don't look at through the normal eyes. This brings us to the chariot and what you need to be aware of. Eight of Wands. Things are going to happen quick. There's communication that's coming in quick. Uh, it may require a decision, and that decision may be one to walk away or walk towards something else. Either way, that decision and what's happening is coming rapidly, and it requires uh, strength to make either one of those choices. The world shows up, the judgment card shows up, and the nine of pentacles shows up. <clears throat> there's success in something that could be coming back from the past, or there's great success coming in from a choice that you... Um, need to make and once you make that choice that frees you and it allows you to um, become more stable if that makes sense Sagittarius I invite you to like share subscribe even dislike if this did not resonate with you best of luck with this week and I will talk to you next time